Now don't talk back. Slow down. Be careful. Get back in line. Don't you know it's against the rules to leave the school grounds without permission? Rule. All the time rules. I'm sick of them. You said Oh, there were no rules. Yeah, then you could do anything you wanted to. Nobody could tell you what to do. Excuse me for interrupting, boys and girls, but maybe you would like to find out just what it would be like if there were no rules. But how could we do that? By going someplace where there are no rules. You'd have to go someplace where there are no teachers or policemen or, or anybody else to tell you what to do. Ah, uh, there's no such place. You're right. Anywhere you go, wherever there are people, you'll find rules. But maybe there is a way we could go to a place without rules. How? By using our imagination. Let's all think real hard and pretend we're in a faraway place. A place no people have discovered yet. Now where could that be? Maybe at the North Pole. Nah, people have been there. Anyway, it's too cold there to be any fun. Maybe an island. Somewhere in the middle of the ocean. All right, a make-believe island. Now let's all pretend real hard. And here we are, the first people to ever be on this island because, well, let's say this island is surrounded by man-eating sharks. Okay, there are no rules here. You can do anything you wish. have no rules, so it doesn't matter if Jim follows the leader or not. Oh. Let's play some other games. Well, where maybe rules aren't so important. How about I and Chief? That's it! That's it. You're last, Jean. You're it. I don't want to be it. Okay. Meeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by the toe. If he wars, let him go. Oh, you T spells out. Oh, she. You're still it, Jean. But I don't want to be it. But you got no, she doesn't, because that's a rule. Then who's gonna be it? Okay, I'll be it. Here's home. One, two, three, four, six, eight, ten. Here I come, ready or not. have rules. Without rules, there would be no games. Oh, what beautiful seashell. I'm going to string some together and make a necklace. Me too. Are there enough? I don't know. Oh, there aren't too many. Hey, come here. I found a mouse. Oh, isn't he cute? His fur is real soft. Let me hold him. No, let me. No, me. No, go find your own mouth. He's being selfish. True, but there's no rule that he should share. Yeah, that's right. But there's no rule says I can't take him either. Let off! He's mine! Now see what you did. He's gone. You tore my 
reject you, you better fix it. Ah, don't be silly. Hey, leave my shoes alone. These are mine. You're the broker. That's not so. You're just taking all the good ones and leaving me the broken ones. Well, there's only enough left for one necklace, and I got them first. That's deal. Give them back. If I can't have them, you can't either. Now see what you did. They're all broken. Well, it's your fault. You tried to take mine. I Gee, not. that was silly, wasn't it? They wasted all their shells. Now nobody can have a necklace. Yes, but that's what happens when there are no rules about taking or wasting things. Look, what are those round things? Coconuts. Let's climb up and get them. Not me. That's too high. Bet you couldn't climb up there either. Bet I could. He'd better be careful or he'll fall and get hurt. Let him. There's no rule says he can't kill himself if he wants to. Gee, Jim, what oh, happened? Jim, are you all right? Oh, my arm. It feels like it's broken. Gee, maybe you should go to the doctor. What doctor? There isn't any here. Couldn't we have a doctor? A doctor would only make rules like keep your arm bandaged until it gets well. Sorry, no rules, no doctors. What'll we do? Hey, what do you think you're doing? Play nurse and try to fix your arm? What do you know about it? Nothing, but somebody's got to do something. Lay up, hey, you're hurt. This is no fun, I'm going swimming. Isn't that a rule, Mark? No, that's just common sense. So are other safety rules. What's the difference between not going in the water where sharks might bite you and not running out in the street where cars might hit you? Okay, let her go ahead if she wants to. Boy, I'm hungry. Me too. What do we do about eating here? Well, there are no parents here to make rules like, you must be home for dinner by six. So I guess it's up to you. Hey, Jim, didn't you knock down a coconut when you fell? I think so, but I don't remember. Here it is. How do you get it open? Here, give me. Like this. Isn't it fun to have a nice meal with your friends with no rules? Nobody to say you have to wash up or be courteous or use good manners. In fact, I don't believe we've heard anyone say please or thank you since we've been on this island. Well, boys and girls, how do you like living without rules? I hate it. This is no fun. It stinks. Well, what can be done about it? Guess if we're going to have any fun, we'd better make some rules. We'll have to. We sure do. Boy, we need them. What kinds of rules do you need? Rules that make things fair for everybody. And safety rules to keep us from getting hurt. We should make a rule that sharks can't bite us. Then we could all go swimming. <laughs> <laughs> and you can be the one to tell the sharks about it. I'm afraid that wouldn't be a good rule, Penny. Rules only work when those they are meant for understand them and know why they should be obeyed. Oh, well, how about courtesy rules? Yeah. yeah, we need lots of rules. So let's get going and make some. Hey, instead of making up a lot of rules, why don't we go home where we already have them? Okay. Yeah. All right. Since we only pretended we were here, all we have to do is 
unpretend. And we're back where we started. Now we have rules again. Do you think you can be happy about rules now? Yes! As long as we remember that rules are to make things better for everybody. Yeah, then if you don't understand a rule, find out why the rule is made. If you really know why, then it will probably make sense. 